What's going on? I'm gonna see if YouTube's gonna allow me to make this video. Now it does. So here is what I wanna say. A month ago, exactly a month ago, on March 22nd, as you all know by now, my monetizations got disabled. Now, by now, I was supposed to still get my last paycheck from Google. How I know that? Because last time when I was there, you know, on the Google, we have a trash called $100, right? So once you reach that, they give you direct deposit. I had like $95.59. And that was by last day of February, okay? Now, I still will be, I was still making money off YouTube between March 1st and March 22nd, the day they cut off my monetization. And I know, and I know, I made over $4 over these three weeks. Now, Based on that, I'm thinking they're supposed to give me my money a couple days ago because they usually give me the money around 20th or 21st of the month when, you know, I, I reach my payment threshold. Guess what? My money is still pending. I didn't get the money. They didn't account for the money I've been making between March 1st and March 22nd. All they said that I need to remove some videos and I, then I can reapply for my monetization. Well, I think that I need to get my money back because I think that I'm supposed to get my last paycheck from Google because I know that during the time between March 1st and March 22nd, I'm sure I made enough money to reach the payment threshold. I know $100 doesn't seem like it's a lot of money, maybe like $100 is some cents, maybe $101, I don't know, whatever it is. But... I think that Need to be fair. But I don't know if it's in this new Jewish world. Fairness is such a thing. They look at it like they're punishing me. Well. America is supposed to be the land of the free and the home of the brave. But as I heard somewhere, that now America is the land of the fee and the home of the slave. And unfortunately, I can say that, yes, America is the land of the fee and the home of the slave. That seems kind of accurate. It also points out who really rules America. And I can see it now more and more in day-to-day -day life. Even more today than a couple years ago. Censorship is getting stronger and stronger. Just like I noticed the relationship between coronavirus and Censorship and less, in, less of hate speech. I've not been noticing a lot of anti-Semitic rhetoric in the last couple of years. When before I used to hear it all, all the time, all the time. And do you think that it all disappeared? No. It's just been 
censored beta, that's all. So yeah, I guess I'm a conspiracy theorist. But... <laughs> 